This weekend is National Faith and Blue Weekend, where law enforcement and faith-based organizations are teaming up to help their communities. In Grand Rapids, that means four days of events that you can check out around town. We're joined this morning by GRPD Captain Kathy Williams and Pastor Daryl Gaddy from Pilgrim Rest. Thank you both for being here this morning. Thank you. This is a national initiative, so let's just get started by talking about what exactly Faith in Blue is. Sure, so Faith in Blue is a national initiative. It started about five years ago, and really the whole premise behind it is law enforcement agencies and faith-based organizations coming together to build up the community. Mm -hmm. And Pastor Gaddy, uh, with your involvement, how do you see this helping the community in Grand Rapids? Well, one of the things that I believe is very important is that as a pastor and faith-based leader, leading people, we have to create and build the partnership between the police and the community, and what a better way than the faith-based community leading that yeah. with these awesome events we're having this weekend. There are some fun events happening, really engaging the community, uh, including a basketball game yes. uh, happening today. Tell us about that. So our youth that are in the GRACE program, the Grand Rapids Alternative Correctional Experience, are playing against the SRT team of the Grand Rapids Police Department tonight at the Paul I. Phillips Boys and Girls Club. And so it's helping our young people look at police officers as real people mm -hmm. and helping police officers understand that even though these youth are some who have gotten in some trouble in their life, that they are, they are not the trouble they're in. They are actually kids who want to be kids. Yeah. So it's bringing them together. Learning more about the people behind the badge. I hope they take it easy. On, the, on these officers <laughs> yeah, We've talked about tonight. that. <laughs> okay. Well, from a pers uh, police perspective, we really want these kids to know that whatever has happened in their past does not define them. Yeah. And although we hold them accountable for decisions that they make, we want to uplift them and support them in their journey as they change the trajectory of their life. Yeah. So the basketball game is just really kicking off this weekend. Tell mm -hmm. us what else we can expect. So Saturday, we have a crime prevention and awareness fair that's mm -hmm. going to be held at first CRC at 651 MLK. And that's from 12 to 2. We'll have all kinds of um, hands-on experiences, resources, and educational materials for mm -hmm. the community. It's going to be family friendly. Everything is free. It's 12 to 2. Okay. And uh, it all kicks off uh, on Sunday or ends on Sunday, I would say, last yes, event? Sunday we are having a worship and reflection where we will honor our first responders in partnership with our Sheriff's Department and our Police Department, okay. pray for them, and award them for the service that they provide in our communities. Okay. Where can people go to learn more about Faith in Blue if they would want to take part in this weekend? Sure. We do have all the events on our Grand Rapids Police Department Facebook page, so all the details are there. Okay, what a great way to bridge the gap uh, here between the community and our police officers. Thank you both for being here. Appreciate you. your time. Thank you.